Hey Crossgates, time for our midweek update. Yes, there is a midweek update between Christmas and New Year's Day, and it's this, generosity. Um, I haven't really um, talked about this yet during the month of December, about the kindness and generosity that is evident in the life of this church. Um, these are the lights of love. Um, this is what our United Methodist women do um, to not only raise money uh, for some of the mission uh, missionary, some of the mission work that they are um, helping support, but it's a way for us to remember. It's a way for us to show love. It's a way for us to show kindness and abundance. And I simply wanted to offer this short update. End the year in generosity. End the year in thanksgiving. Thanking God for these people that are, that are in our lives as this primary gift. Finding ways to do something that is simple but meaningful. A gift in memory of, a gift in honor of, a meal, a conversation, a phone call, a lunch visit, a simple word of kindness. Um, this, is, this is what we seek. This is what um, we become when we become followers of Jesus Christ. This is what we mean when we say, I see Christ in you, is that we become these kind of people. These kind of kind and loving and attentive people. And so... As we are now approaching a new year, we want to start the year strong as well. We want to finish this one strongly and, and start the new one strongly. And so um, this coming Sunday is Epiphany Sunday, and we're going to hear about um, the, the Magi, these wise men, what they were seeking, why they were seeking it, and who they found. But again, they brought with them gifts of kindness and generosity, of gold and frankincense and myrrh and acknowledgement and a desire to be a part of something. Um, that's my midweek update. My midweek update is let's end this year the way that we began this month. Um, aware of light and how small kind acts can bring light into people's lives. To say thanks be to God. To come together in worship. Um, this Sunday we will be celebrating communion again. It's the first Sunday of a month, and it's the first Sunday of the year, so we will come and we'll celebrate that again um, as a way of being called to the table to receive a gift of simple bread and a simple cup to remind us of God's great love and provision for us. Do you see how it's all connected? So, um, Crossgates, I hope you have um, a, a good amount of festivities for um, New Year's Eve that you're surrounded by family and friends, or at least you're safe when you do it with this COVID mess. But um, give thanks to God for a beautiful year, a way in which God truly was present, and a new coming year in which God will continue to grow with abundance and kindness and generosity to us, and we will continue to be transformed into that image of generosity, that image of goodness, of the image of forgiveness and grace. Cross gates. I'll see you Sunday. I'll see you next year. I see Christ in you. I love you.